Hi guys, and welcome back to Traff Tutorials. So in this video, I brought a friend with me. Hello. So Bogdan, welcome. I heard you need some help with setting up your uh, business account. Yes, I'm a consultant and I don't have a website or any booking system that I can configure my appointments, employees, and etc., etc. So I'm tired of uh, phone calls and booking through that. So can you show me the way how can I go digital? Great, Traff can do just that for you and I'm going to show you everything from the st first step to how you can start accepting your bookings with Draft. Please do so. So if you go on our website and go on Try for Free, you will see your sign up and here you can use just your email, your business email to sign up to your uh, Draft account and create your first uh, account and user which you can use. Uh, so you just enter your first name, your password, uh, your last name, and all of the general information. You can also use the social sign up. And after that, this is just some uh, customization for your booking website. So you said you're a consultant. That's what we're going to use. And then your company names, let's say Bogdan Consulting. And just your company URL, uh, that is uh, what is going to be your URL for your uh, booking website, .trav.com. And then your admin dashboard is going to have just the uh, admin, bogdanconsulting.admin.trav.com. Even when you agree to terms of use, continue, you can choose the appearance of your booking website. So I think you will like the dark default one the best. Yeah. <laughs> and then just create your account. Uh, while it's creating, you're going to need to set up one or two things in Traff before you can start accepting your bookings. And this is it. This is your Traff dashboard. From here, you can start. And the first thing you need to configure are your services. So let's say just go under services, add service, and you're going to have a consulting session. You can add a photo here, uh, add some description. So best consulting coach at your disposal and then if you just select an employee i will also show you later how you can create additional employees you can set your duration so let's say one hour and then you can set the price and that's it. You created your service. You can mm -hmm. go to service and configure some additional options, which we will cover in some further videos. But for now, this is just enough to start accepting your bookings. Under employees, I already assigned you as a super admin. But if you have more members in your team, you can add another employee. Let's say Olga and my last name, my email. And... You can also add a certain description, phone number, mm -hmm. whatever. You can upload a photo. This is your photo. Okay, but yeah. <laughs> you, can, you can, for example, edit mine, employee, yeah, and then, I can... then add the photo of it. So now I'm going to leave this blank for now until I can find a photo I like of myself. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> you can add some uh, services assigned to which services uh, you want this employee to be Assigned, you can have all, have custom pricing, set up their working hours, which is the availability for your services, days off. Again, there are more options which we will cover in further videos. Uh, let's set your image because you're like yeah. yours. <laughs> Click to upload, uh, choose the image that you want. And this is it. Now, when I go on your booking website, you can see everything we just created. So your booking website is here in the top left corner. And this is it. This is everything you're currently offering. These are just some dummy services that were created for you by Traft, but the service that I just created, uh, you can see here. And if I just go to the, uh, click on the service, go on the book, you begin the booking process. So your customers can choose if they want to create a book with a, an account or as a guest. For now, I'm just going to do the guest and you can choose between the two mm -hmm. employees. I'm going to choose you and continue. They're now selecting the dates and the time when they want to book. So 23rd of September at 11.30. And then they can just enter some of their information. So I'm just going to use Mary Smith, enter their email. Again, this is all customizable. You can choose if the email needs to be mandatory or not, mm -hmm. as well as the phone. You can add some custom fields. Again, all of those we will cover in further videos. And then they just click on book. And that's it. They have booked their first appointment. When I go back to the admin dashboard under appointments, I can view the appointment that had just been booked. I can view some additional information about it. And 
under calendar, I can also see the calendar view of, of everything that you have in the next month or week, day, whatever you, you prefer. And that's it. That's the basic rundown. So just like that, I can accept my bookings and view my customers and employees. Just like that. In under a few minutes, you have ready to go and you just need to fill your data and that's it. Awesome. You have more options that you can, we will cover in further videos from customization, notifications, reminders, whatever you need, different features and integrations. But for your basic bookings, this is all you need to get started with Raft. Okay, thank you, Olga. Thank you, Bogdan, for joining me today. Please, guys, this helped me a lot. So don't forget to like, share and subscribe. See you in the next one. Bye.